The lawsuit against Palm led to the uh, situation where Palm had to pay compensation to uh, Xerox. Uh, in addition, because of the uh, imposition of costs, uh, Palm had to move to what it called Graffiti 2. Uh, now, Graffiti 2 was a similar language uh, using a two stroke system for each letter, for each digit, whatever. So, every, everything you, you are accustomed to doing, uh, the way you are used to putting uh, letters and to put some input uh, into the device, had to be revised. And I, as a user, had to, res to study things again, or not study anything again if I could stay with Graffiti 1, which I did. Uh, and that's just because of a patent lawsuit which basically said uh, that Xerox had the, the ownership or so-called ownership of the, of the idea of how to implement this type of thing. Now, one could argue, you know, this is, this is acceptable, you know, Pump could pay for it and, you know, they should permit this to happen. Well, the fact is it didn't happen. Uh, even if they stayed with graffiti, uh, the original graffiti, I would still have to pay more just for a very trivial idea of trying to encode each letter using a single stroke. It doesn't take so much to, to think about this, uh, you know, to, to think that you could actually basically do what you're doing on paper, uh, you know, just, just stroking an A or stroking a triangle and something out there just takes the direction of the strokes and figures out, well, he's probably trying to type down an A. You know, but this is this is this is what patents bring about. Uh, this was removed. I had to suffer because of that. So Palm had to suffer because of that, and all the users. Uh, and that was my first introduction to software patents, in a sense, and especially the harms to uh, consumers. Uh, at a time as a developer, I did not work for Palm, even though I did hang out in the forums and news groups and try to help people out with their Palm devices. Uh, but I, I did realize that if I was working for this company and I'd have to like check patent application, it would be absolute, an absolute nightmare. As soon as you sell lots of devices, all those companies come after you and demand to you know, get share of your uh, profits and basically harm your users because they want the users to suffer so that they move to a different device, perhaps one that's made by Xerox.